Hi guys, Ox here. Welcome back to Way In Wednesday. Today's vlog is going to be like a little bit discombobulated because I'm going to be showing a, a few clips from Thursday and my Way In from Wednesday. And right now it's Friday, so you guys know how I do. I kind of like to film these on Thursday and Friday. That's kind of like what I've been doing when it comes to my channel and these vlogs, these Way In Wednesday vlogs. So the Way In's always going to be on Wednesday. And right now I'm going to be getting some food pretty soon and I'll probably show you guys what I get. We're going to be getting some healthy fast food choice today because um my arm is hurting a little bit i don't feel like cooking anything today for you guys but the first topic we're going to talk about um on this in this vlog is going to be my gender now why are you talking about this is this important um it's important because i just get a lot of comments a lot of questions asking me like are you like transitioning or something or are you were you born a female and i just thought i would go ahead and answer those questions for you guys who were thinking about them now okay i just want to preface this by saying um basically no the answer is no <laughs> It's not, I don't want this to be like clickbait or anything, but I just want to set the record straight because I'm kind of tired of the comments, to be honest. And a lot of people are very negative about it and I don't think that's okay. So I was born a man and I identify as a man. Um, I use he, him pronouns unless you're, you know, part of the LGBT and you want to say like sister. Well, James Charles kind of killed sister, but you know what I mean? Like, or like girl my pronouns are he him and girl pretty much so I just wanted to clear that up because like I said I'm kind of tired of the comments I myself am a trans ally like um I support you guys if there's anyone out there in the audience you guys have my full support and I'm just tired of people leaving those comments and it's always very negative like you are not um offending me by calling me trans um it's not offensive it's just disgusting all right you guys so now back to our regular programming i hope that didn't come off like harsh or whatever i just you guys know like you guys know like if you know you know you know what i mean um so let's talk about my weight this week and how we were doing with that let me insert my way in right here Okay, as you guys can see, we are making steady progress, 173 something, um, I kind of forget. <laughs> but look at my weight the next day, you guys. Yes, I was 172.4, if you know, you know. But anyways, I've been going on my, I've been doing my typical IF. Um, I've been doing like the 16, 1700-ish calories a day, except for Easter Sunday. I probably ate more than that. I didn't count anything. I didn't count anything that I ate. I had cake. I had a lot of different kind of food. Let me turn off my wipers because they're kind of annoying, right? I don't even know how to work it. Okay, it's off. Um, so someone's getting like arrested over there. I'm not even kidding you guys. I'm a little bit like nervous now. We're good. <laughs> it's not me. Okay. So, yeah, I went over my calories on Easter Sunday. I had cake, I had ham, I had mashed potatoes. I'm sure it was like 2,500 if I had to guesstimate how many calories I had. But, you know, that's the thing. I don't really do like cheat days or anything as far as my calories go, but um, I'll let you guys know if I do. Uh, as far as that goes, um, holidays, I just eat whatever, you know, it's only like a few days a year and I'm not going to like deprive myself of that food on those days. So that was my wait for this week. So let's talk about the vaccine. So I'm going to insert my clip right here of me at the vaccination site. I'm actually here getting my vaccine right now. The line is a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. I mean, I have an appointment already, so I'm like, why is there a huge line? How many people do they schedule for the same time slot? I don't know. I'm a little bit nervous, so I'm going to catch you guys up when I'm done. Um, yeah. All right, you guys, I just got my shot. Look, look, look. I just got my first dose of the Pfizer. I feel good. You barely even felt it. 
the lady like i i clocked her technique she would like chat you up as soon as she put the needle in she knew exactly what she was doing great service at this place very smooth very easy we don't feel anything yet all right you guys so i got the first dose of my vaccine i got the pfizer vaccine and side effects as far as that goes i don't have any i have a really sore arm it's pretty sore up here it was very sore last night but i feel like it's a little bit better now it's still pretty sore but it's nothing that you can't like deal with i could probably take some tylenol and it would feel better but i don't feel like i even really need tylenol so other than that i don't really have any symptoms i have my next dose um, scheduled to be taken at the end of the month and then we will be good. I have my vaccination card in my wallet and that is almost taken care of. I just have to wait for the few weeks to go by so you can get your second dose. Um, I went with Pfizer because that is just what they had. Let me know if you guys have any experiences or which vaccine you decided to get or if you just kind of went with whatever was there. That's what I did, whatever was there. And I don't know if you guys could tell, but I also got my eyebrows done yesterday by a professional. Usually I just have someone in my family do it, but this time we got them done at an actual waxing place. And I think that they look so good. She knew what I wanted. She knew like I wanted it to be about a finger apart. I just like this look. I think that it looks good. Um, I used to do it like, as you guys can see, my eyebrow growth is not the best right here and right here. Um, it looks a little bit more wispy, but that's because I used to like go back that far and it didn't look good. It did not look good. I think that this looks so much better. It just suits my face and the lady who did it did a really nice job. Hello, welcome to Taco Bell. How are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm doing good. Thanks for asking. What can I get for you? Uh, may I have the power menu bowl with chicken? Gotcha. Anything else? Can I have the uh, Diet Pepsi, please, in a medium? Gotcha. And Anything else, then? That'll be all today. And any sauces? We have mild hot fire in Diablo. I'll do the fire sauce. And everything that's right on your screen. Perfect. Perfect. It'll be 7.30 at the window then. Alright. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so stupid. <laughs> That's not even funny. Like, you're an idiot. I'm serious. Like, okay social isolation is getting to me like i don't even know how to behave in public there's nothing wrong with that though right okay i have my vaccination card i don't know if, like i probably don't want to show it on youtube it's in here though oh my god the car like two behind me i don't know if you guys can see it do you see that red car i don't want red but it's a chr i kind of i really want that car but I just have to tell myself, like, be grateful for what you have, bitch. Like, seriously, you don't need a car. It would be, it's like a waste because <sighs> I just really want it. Be grateful, bitch. Got the goods. Okay, you guys, we are ready to eat. I should probably take my seatbelt off. You guys are going to make fun of me. You have your seatbelt on me, you're back. <laughs> I'm just very safe. I'm just very safe. What do you want from me? So we got the power menu bowl. Let me show you guys. A Diet Coke. Or Pepsi, sorry. I like Pepsi. Do you guys like Coke or Pepsi? I swear to goodness. Oh my gosh, I almost had like a heart attack because I didn't know if they gave me any utensils. Can you imagine? I wouldn't be able to do the video, really. I mean, that would be just, that would be nasty. Okay. So this is our first time having fast food in a very long time. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Why is that so hard to open? So we got the power menu bowl. This is our healthy fast food option coming in at only 470 calories. It's 
kind of like a Taco Bell taco. There's the chicken. There is that delicious chicken. It's like an unwrapped taco. No? And my favorite part, I can't really do a mukbang because I don't have like a tray or anything, but we can do a taste test, right? The sauce. When they forget the sauce, they always forget the sauce and it's like the best part. And it's times like these where you can't just like run in and grab a handful. So you're really screwed. Just put it all over. That's what you got to do. This sauce is, I believe, zero calories. I think. I think it's zero calories. Hopefully. Let's try some of that chicken. Mm. That's good. Like I said, I'm just lazy today. I don't plan on getting this like all the time. Or having fast food. When I do my diets, I don't do fast food. But let's just say rarely. All right, you guys, that's going to be it for today's video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Did you guys get a vaccine? Are you on a diet? What are you doing? Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I will, of course, catch you guys in the, the next one. Bye, guys.